to see it. They fucking, <laughs> the way they fight, they fucking throw their hands up. Busted in part one, I'm busting it. To what? I don't fucking know. Hey Jimmy, how you doing? Terrible, everybody hates me. Everybody might hate you, but everybody laughs at me. Yeah, that's true. Those kids are jerks anyway, but I tried. I know! I mean, I tried to do the right thing, make people happy, stop all the fighting, make everyone calm down. Now everyone laughs at me. People used to be scared of me, and now I'm a joke. It was Gary. It must have been. I know. I can't deal with the fact that that kid beat me. Well, it ain't over yet. God, one minor setback, and you're acting like a baby. You're pathetic. I've been expelled. They're just waiting for my mother to come back from her 58th honeymoon, then I'm out of here. How is that a minor setback? Losers! Oh, shut up, you fat dork. Whatever. You and your has-been friend don't scare me. See? Even a dork like that laughs at me. We gotta prove Gary was behind everything. We don't even know if it was Gary. All we know is townie kids beat up a bunch of Bullworth kids. I mean, I don't even care anymore. Well, we've gotta find out what's going on. Come on! Okay, but if we're gonna take on those townies, we're gonna need a bunch of backup. Someone big who doesn't hate me yet. Russell. Russell. He'll be at his house at Old Bullworth Vale. Yep, Russell. Fucking Russell the steroid. Fucking Andre. I'll be a virgin of you. God damn it. Fun. I was just trying to oh my god. It's Look just like on. riding a bike. Next weekend for right, no can you particular go please? Reason. Fuck off. Kindly fucking fuck off that. Jesus Christ. It's, oh my lord. The loaded and light. Russell, I need your help to bust into the dropout's hideout. Damn, he doesn't want to see Only if Russell gets to destroy. He gets a motorcycle.
Damn! They're locked! Ah! What the fuck? Why? Oh, that's gotta hurt! <laughs> Boom! Uh-oh! This doesn't look so good! Why is he chasing the police? What the hell do you think you're doing? What do you mean? Smashing into our barricade like that? Completely out of control. Are you crazy? I've got to talk to that Edgar kid. I don't think he wants to talk to you. And you can't get in while the power is out anyways. The Red Star building. This gate is controlled by an electronic security. What's the whole reason that we, this is possible since we got, we need Russell to help? I guess not. I guess we can help. to get to the chem plant and to do that we've got to take on Omar he's Edgar's right-hand man he's the only one with the key to the plant This 
this'll come in handy. Something about he's like there is something big. I think it's just huge. The fun's over here, Jimmy.
Wait, they can't really spill onto the official I'm just gonna make it. I'm not gonna lie. What's the fucking word, the void? I'm gonna break your face! There you go. Now they- Ha <laughs> ha! You're not sure what you think you are, kid. You're gonna need more help. gonna be fun. Die. Maybe what I did fuck, deserve that. Man. Please don't make me go through all that again. Like, please get. Isn't there some kind of saving system though? Like. Oh yeah. I'm gonna break your face. Oh yeah. Let's see what you can do with that. Oh, <laughs> You're not as strong as you think. I still survive it. You had enough? You want some more? Come on, big guy. You still think messing with me is a good idea? No, no, no. Good. That's what I thought. Now, what made you think it was a good idea in the first place? Aw, oh, man. I hate that school. My parents couldn't afford to send me there, and now I'm stuck in this dump of a town. Gary said we'd make them all pay. Wait a second. Gary? That backstabbing two-faced sociopath put you up to this? Ah, I bet he said the two of you would take over the school or some crap. Hey, how'd you know? Because he told me the same garbage. Didn't do me any good either. Come on, you're gonna help me make him pay for his lies. Mm-hmm, he used him. You know, you're all right, Jimmy. Yeah, okay. See ya. That was easy. Damn. Jesus. Can't never have too much sugar. Nice. Come on, Sugar Rush. <laughs> but, uh, this game, lots of fun. It's silly, but it's lots of fun. Does anything 
I meant to die on these streets. It's like... What's going on? What you doing around right here? Yeah, now they don't hate me, but everyone else still does, so... Where's that shit? Alright, let's talk to Zoe. Like, like... Damn. Complete mayhem. What the hell are you doing here? Looking for you, Zoe. I think I'm in love. Don't be ridiculous. Haven't you heard? Heard what, my love? The school has broken out into a massive fight. Every gang and faction is fighting each other. What? Yeah. Oh, man, I gotta go. How am I gonna deal with this? I'm gonna need some serious backup. Where's Russell? Where's your buddy Edgar? Russell has been holed up in the Wonder Meat slaughterhouse, hiding from the cops. He's worried about going to prison after stealing that bike. Russell can comprehend prison? Wow. Look, I'll see you later. Well... What about love? It'll have to wait, Zoe. Duty calls. <laughs> Maybe I should grow a beard. Chicks love that. Alright. So if I can save Russell, I guess. That little runt. Thanks, Jimmy. Come on, we gotta get to the school. All hell's breaking loose. Hey, Jim, this is your turf. What the hell's going on? The whole place has gone mental. Yeah, it's your old friend Gary. He's the one causing all the trouble. The kid's a complete psycho, and now he's got the teachers and prefects on his side. So? So, we run in there, try to stop the fighting, and find a way to deal with Gary. <laughs> all right, one question. Shouldn't the cops be How are we gonna stop a load of kids from beating the crap out of each other? It's America. We go in there with threats and bribes until we get what we want. If all else fails, we beat the crap out of everyone. That's why I brought along backup. Russell likes to hurt people for peace. Cool. Then it's a plan. Jesus. Damn! They're locked! Don't worry. Russell will get it. Grr! Grr! 
that kind of hurt. Edgar, we'll take out the gang leaders. Without them, Gary's got nothing. Shouldn't the cops be all over the This is the library, I think. Hey, Dirk! Someone's here to see you. Oh! It's the thug! Don't worry, boys. I'll deal with him. You're getting really tiresome, Darby. Cut it out! Get back here, you going nowhere!
pushes the greasers or grease balls or whatever they're called again. This is the girl's dorm. What the fuck, man? It doesn't get any better than this. What the hell are you doing, Johnny? Why are you taking orders from Gary? Shut up, Jimmy. You left us and everything went down the toilet. I beat you once, I'll beat you again. I need to work on that. You bunch of bitches! That was incredibly satisfying! Edgar, go help everyone calm down. I've got some business with Gary. Understood. Good luck. <laughs> you, what is that in your hand? Weapons are for prefects only. No! Get off my little body! Slow down so Russell can smash you! Aw, oh, come on. Your attention, please. Jimmy is complete human trash. Gary, you little bitch! Come out! James, I've been waiting. Let the games begin. Gary's gonna fucking go down. He just makes you hate him, dude. He's not like the. the Gary! Moron! Why'd you do it, Gary? Why not? I won! I tricked everyone! Starting with you, the head, the loser kids in town, and the prefects! Me! I won! You are sad, man! I might be sad, but I've won your world, moron! And don't you forget it! You did. All my dirty work for me, Hopkins. You're like a puppet, only dumber. Whatever. Let's finish this. All right. Gary. Fuck you. Fuck you, Gary. Fuck you. If you prove to be one thing this year, it's slow. You'll never catch me, Hopkins. You're too trusting, Jimmy. From the start, you were pathetically naive. Careful, don't hurt yourself. Poor little Jimmy. All alone at Big Scary Bullworth, under fire from Russell and his goons, desperate for help. So sad, so hopeless. 
friends. Just needing a friend. Any friend. You were so easy to manipulate, Jimmy. Heads up! Are you having fun yet, Jimmy? And once we were friends, it was all so clear. You had your lust for power, but without intelligence to back it up, using you as a pawn was so wonderfully obvious. Let Jimmy have his fun. Let him play his childish little games with Ernest, Ted, Darby, Johnny, and Edgar, and just wait for the right moment to swoop in and take it all. Lining up dominoes, it all fell together so perfectly. You were off wasting your time with whores like Lola. I was in the door planning. While you were racing bikes, If I win, you're just another punk! You win, and you'll be sent away even quicker for beating up the head boy! Why'd you do it, Gary? Because I can! Because making little people like you and the morons who run this place eat out of the palm of my hand feels great! But I never did anything to you! You would've if I'd given you the chance! Face it, I'm smarter than you! Oh, congratulations! <laughs> you're smarter than me! You hate everyone, and everyone hates you! Genius! The head likes me! I tied him up, turned his dumb school into a battleground, got kids expelled, unfairly, put several others into therapy, and he still likes me! You're such a loser! <laughs> well, at least my mom doesn't make her living on her back! You're dead! <laughs> no! I can take you, Hopkins! Jimmy, out of my way! Damn, I just sent him through the fucking glass. I mean, I went through two- Smith! I heard the whole thing! You're expelled! Come and untie me, boy! Yes, sir! <sighs> Sorry, didn't see you there. You know, I think I may have judged you too unfairly, boy. Yes, a little rough around the edges, but you're a diamond, boy. A diamond. Thank you, sir. Now take out the trash, would you, Hopkins? My pleasure. So it was you who took on this monstrous little wretch, was it? Yep. <laughs> what a hero. A lone wolf. Uh-huh. Well, no. To be honest, sir, I did have a lot of help from some friends. Like this girl, Zoe. She got expelled because she complained about Mr. Burton hitting on her. Burton? Well, he's fired. I hope he rots in hell. And a guy named Peter Kowalski, good friend of mine. Never heard of him. Yeah, well, he keeps quiet. He's kind of shy. Shy? The boy must be a genius. Why, he should be head of the school. Pete? Great idea. Now, about that letter to my mother. What letter? <laughs> no more letter. Goodbye, Gary, you piece of trash. Finally, everything is sorted out, more or less. I mean, I don't want to say we're going to live happily ever after or anything like that, but life is certainly going to get easy. Why did all the most of the that was cool? 